Hi, this is Ryan from AccuTune Off-Road and today I'm going to show you why we don't recommend uh, shock spacers for lifting your Toyota Tacoma 4Runner or Tundra. So this vehicle here has an inch and a quarter spacer on it. And so it's basically spacing the whole shock down and making the extended length of the shock an inch and a quarter longer, which equates to about three quarters of an inch longer than you would have on an extended travel coilover. And so that extra three quarters of an inch equates about an extra inch and a half of droop at the wheel over an extended travel coilover. And so by letting the wheel droop down that extra inch and a half, you start running into a lot of clearance issues with the control arm hitting the shock, uh, we see sometimes the ball joint hits the shock. The uh, CV boots really, really don't like that. The steering doesn't like it. Basically, it causes all these components to wear out a lot more quickly. So if, you, if you're going to lift your Tacoma, the best bet is get an extended travel coilover. It does have more droop than the factory one, but not too much droop. And then you pair that with an aftermarket upper control arm. You can get the correct alignment and nothing will hit, it, hit each other and all of your front end components will last a lot longer. For more information, check out our website, accutuneoffroad.com or follow us on Instagram or Facebook. Thank you.